Hello everyone. My name is Steven and I'm on the SKU IQ development team. Uh, today we're going to show you how to sync a new item into TikTok shop from SKU IQ. The scenario we have here is that we are already syncing items to TikTok shop from our Shopify account, as we can see here. These products are syncing, uh, but we have this new product here that we'd like to sync to TikTok shop. To do so, there are a couple ways we can do this. Um, the first of which we can actually do the quick select menu right here. And what we can do is when you click an item or multiple items, you'll notice that this little action menu pops up. Uh, if we go and select this, we can actually use this to push the item to TikTok shop. Um, so if we click this here, we'll see this little menu pop up. Uh, and it'll hold all the items that we have selected to push. Now, since this is a new item, it hasn't been synced to TikTok shop, and it does not have a TikTok category. TikTok requires categories for your products, so this allows us to set this product category here. Uh, this is an album, so I'll just type in uh, vinyl, and we'll see that we have uh, collections entertainment, CD, DVD, and vinyl records. I think that matches our category, so I'm going to put that as my category for my item and go ahead and push. We'll get this little notification here that we have uh, taken the push and we are now processing it. We can go ahead and hit OK. And now we'll wait for this guy to go ahead into our TikTok shop. If we give this page a little refresh here, we'll see now that this item is indicating that it is now syncing. If we go ahead and we check our TikTok shop and we give it a little refresh here, we should see that this item now appears. There it is. Now, when an item first gets in, you'll notice that it is being reviewed by TikTok. This is normal. Uh, when this one has been reviewed, which shouldn't take too long, it'll generate into an active state as we can see here. Um, for now, though, let's try the other way of pushing an item into TikTok shop. So we've seen that we can send one in with a bulk push here on the products page. We can also do this uh, from the individual product page itself. So if we actually click this item, we'll enter, we'll enter into the product details page here. Uh, and from here, I'm actually gonna remove this from TikTok shop so we can show pushing it from here. So if we do this and save our changes, we'll see that this item will be removed from our TikTok shop. All right, let's give this a refresh here, and we'll notice that the POS item number has vanished. This indicates that the item is now removed from TikTok shop. Sure enough, if we go ahead and we refresh our page here in TikTok shop, we'll see that that item is no longer present. As we can see here. Now let's go ahead and push this guy back into TikTok shop. And we can do so right here, as I mentioned on the product details page using this same toggle. We'll click this and we'll save our changes. All right, and we'll give this page a little refresh and we'll see that we now have a POS item number again. This indicates that now the item has been pushed to TikTok shop and should be present for us. We'll give our TikTok a little refresh here And voila, we have our Funk album back. It is suspended as it is being reviewed, but as soon as it is reviewed, it'll show up in an active state. So these are the two ways you can uh, push an item to TikTok shop. One of which again is right here on the products list itself. The other is going into the item and pushing it individually. I hope this has been helpful.